All right, so you've got a client and they just give you an objection and they say to you, is that MLM? And you're like, oh no, because you can feel their energy and they don't like MLM. And all of a sudden you get defensive and you're like, no, this isn't MLM. This is not one of those pyramid schemes. This is actually a lot different. Well, my friend, why do people have this mindset behind network marketing or MLM? Because if you knew what I knew about the industry and I've lived in the other industry, I was raised by a family that had an actual brick and mortar business. And I did not want to do that in life. I was raised since I was 12 years old in their company and I got to see the whole thing start. I got to see the hundreds of thousands of dollars of inventory that were on the shelf. I got to see all these employees, 40 employees. A lot of them stood around all day, watching their watch, texting on their cell phone, in the bathroom, hiding. And then you had to pay them. My parents had to actually physically pay them for work I didn't even feel that they were deserving of. So I got to see that whole side. My parents were slaves living in their business. They were there day in and day out, holidays, Christmas, every holiday you can imagine. We were living in the business. At least we got to be as a family, so that was a benefit. But there was no time freedom. So when I seen what network marketing can do and their business structure, I was like, what? You don't have to pay employees. You don't have to stock inventory. You don't have to have a brick and mortar store where you're paying rent. Wow, sign me up. This sounds amazing. So you're telling me that I master the sales ability and the skills and I can actually sell the product and get a commission and I can have time freedom where I can live on my laptop and travel around the world and do the things that I want to do. Man, that's awesome. And so there is such a benefit of network marketing, just that alone, right? But here's what people are told when they get into the industry. And you've probably been there too. Oh, you are going to love this business because you can make all this money. My friend Susie, she just joined and she's already made $100,000 and it only took her four months to do so. So I want to introduce you to Susie and I want you guys to share some information here and, and Susie's going to help you. Well, now you, new person, never been in business, don't realize that Susie was part of another network marketing company and she decided to leave that company for whatever reason and now she's in a new company. And all those people came with Susie. So now Susie made all that money because of all these people that she already knew that would follow her anywhere that she went. And so when you're getting in the business, that doesn't happen to you. And you're still trying to figure out how to sell. You don't realize that you got to prospect. You got to find people. You got to invite the people to a product demonstration. You got to learn the product demonstration yourself. You've got to follow up. You've got to close, you've got to duplicate yourself, you've got to build for events. Those are the mindset, that's the skills you acquire when you come into this industry. So once you get good at those, it becomes simple. I didn't say easy, I said simple. Once that happens, you have those skills and it's a way of life. Then you start getting momentum and pretty soon people are start coming to you to want you to lead them and to coach them. And so there's always this limiting belief behind the business because people get recruited because they truly believe that they can get rich quick. Anything in life, if you really want it, you're going to have to work for it. Network marketing, right? You have to work for it. It's not just going to come all the income just like that. Okay. Another reason that it gets a bad, bad reputation, the stigma, is because the compensation plan is out on the market. That means people can see it. People don't realize business. They don't realize that those pair of shoes you're wearing right now, those Louis Vuittons, they probably didn't cost a thousand dollars, did they to make? No, they probably got it from a factory in China. Those shoes probably cost maybe a hundred, probably not even that. 
And so the customer just bought a pair of shoes for $1,000, but they don't realize because it's not on the market that those shoes really only cost $100. So there's a big gap in there. What's the gap? It's advertising. You've got to advertise the product in order to get it out. You have to have the celebrities and all these professional athletes out there with supporting the brand. They have to have income for doing that. So now all of that is profit, but now it's allocated to advertising. So it would have been pure profit until you had these expenses that go against it. And so because our products are out in the marketplace and they see the compensation plan, they automatically assume that we're making all this money, not realizing that the word of mouth is how we advertise. We don't put marketing dollars out there. So we get to achieve the income. We don't have to pay it out to everyone else. Plus we're working with the manufacturer. A lot of these other companies out there, let's say it's, um, well, for instance, my, my family's garden center, they would buy the statuary. So the statuary, let's say it costs a thousand. It goes to a middleman. That middleman finds all the pieces that they can gather for the lowest price from the manufacturer. So now you have the manufacturer. So the manufacturer is the one that makes the product. And then this middleman is the one that grabs all the product. The retail, the retail is the one that buys it from here, the wholesale price, and then marks it out into the public. So it's marked up typically two times or around 60% of the cost. With network marketing, most of it is coming directly from the manufacturer. So we can actually get the lowest cost. So those are just some things that people see and that's why they don't like the industry. And if you really truly knew about the industry, you would be 100% on board with it because it is exactly what you want as a business. You have no liability. You have something that you can put in your body that gets results that everybody must have in life to survive. And you can give it away for free. You just gotta work on yourself. Personal development is key. When I was getting started in this business, um, you know, there came a time I was really frustrated, really frustrated where I wanted to give up. And it wasn't because I was make, not making income and sales. It was because I couldn't figure out how to duplicate myself. I overcomplicated everything and I was not duplicatable. That is when I decided to hire coaching coaches. I worked with some of the top coaches in the industry. I know you've heard of Eric Worre, JT Fox, who's known as the number one's world wealth coach, Jeffrey Combs, almost two years with Jeffrey, personal development, Robert Kiyosaki, and he is a smart man. His, one of his things he says in his book, MLM is so good, if it wasn't already out, I would have developed it myself. So I got to learn from him. So there's all these coaches I've worked with. You've heard of Brendan Burchard, Frank Kern, Grant Cardone, in order to be where you want to be in life, you've got to learn from someone that's already been there and learned the skills. So if you're looking for an opportunity, you're looking for a business, connect with me because I've been there. I've learned from the top people in the industry and I'm willing to coach you as long as you're attached to me and my business or you go on the membership program, which is only $97 a month and you will get me as your coach to help guide you and show you exactly how to get there because Behind that door, there's a lot of fear. It's the unknown. You're stepping out into the unknown. And when you have someone that's already been through that door, knows what's on the, on the other side and it's worth it, you want to have someone that's going with you to help guide you through that door so that, that fear doesn't stop you and procrastinate you from fulfilling your goals and your dreams in life. So if you're looking for that opportunity, you found it, my friend. We are here, we have the best product in the industry. So you go out there, give me a call, get involved, and until you do, be happy, be healthy, and be free.